Hello and welcome to the very first full face, fresh face model search competition. This is the first time this competition has come to Northern Ireland and it's going to give the chance for a local girl to go to London and become a top model. Now there have been two heats so far and this is the last heat before the big final next week in Derry. Now the girls have all been absolutely fantastic but who will be crowned the winner of the Derry heat? Well we'll just have to wait and see. I'm joined with four hopefuls that are hoping to go home with the Derry title. So who have we got here? What's your name? Aoife McDade. Hey I'm Zach. Here, my Levi. Michaela Glenn. Now, you two look like twins. Are you related? Uh, we're cousins. We're cousins. And why did you decide to enter the competition? Um, I just thought it'd be a great opportunity if I did get through, and I thought it'd be great fun as well, and I'd get to meet new people. So, it's always a good experience on my part, I think. So, it's a great opportunity, and it is all about the experience. And I'm sure, if you don't get it here, then hopefully you'll get it somewhere else. And have you ever done any kind of modelling before? Yeah, I have. I've done lo loads of local work and stuff like that and I love doing anything to do with modelling so I'm up for anything really. And why would you like to become a top model in London? Um, I think it would be a good experience and to meet lots of people and it would be a good future. Now I don't know about you but I'd be very nervous if I was to get up and walk down the catwalk. Have you done catwalk stuff before? I've done catwalk before. I've done the top model for Derry or the competition and there was a catwalk involved in that there. I also done catwalk for the Fisidary and the Fis of Ireland and for Miss Global. So, so you do, you've done a lot then? Yeah. <laughs> and what about yourself? Uh, yeah, I've done a bit for the study as well. We, I took part in the, the Vantage Face of 2013. I actually won that myself and there was a catwalk uh, done on that as well. So. so what do you think it takes to be a full face, fresh face model? Um, looks and a really good personality. Uh, beauty inside and out. Uh, quirky, different, uh, yeah, personality, definitely, 100% personality. I think just uh, natural complexion, just natural beauty without the makeup, as well as with the makeup on, and then as well as everyone has to say in the personality as well to go with it. And do you think the winner is going to come out of Derry? joined with the lovely Linda who is one of the representatives for Benefit Makeup. Now Benefit are giving a lovely prize for one of the winners, tell me a bit about it. Uh, well basically they're given a goodie bag worth £350 and also they're given free makeupers for a year. That would be a treat. So why have Benefit decided to come on board with this competition? What is the partnership being? Well basically um, Natalie is an all uh, women creative brand and we are quite a fun, boldly creative brand ourselves so we thought the link up would be inappropriate. And it's great to basically find a girl from Northern Ireland and give them that opportunity that they maybe wouldn't have had. Join now with Fashion Man himself, so you know all about fashion. Tell me, we're at the break, what did you think so far? I think, as I was saying just a bit before the interval started, amazing competition tonight in terms of the calibre, the standard of the gears. You know, a lot of these gears have never actually been on a catwalk before, so I'm really, really impressed as to how well they're doing tonight. And more than anything, they're coping with their nerves. You know, there's been a lot of nerves in the dressing room, and it's amazing to see that they're actually channeling their energy and making it part of their confidence, you know, and it's really working in their advantage, so I'm really impressed. Now we're in the UK City of Culture and there have been a lot of events throughout the last couple of months, but this is a new event to Derry and to Northern Ireland. Do you think this is a great idea that Natalie has come over here to try and poach 
fresh talent to bring over to London. Absolutely. In terms of the model searches that we've had here in a number of years, you know, this is a new concept where we've had someone coming from London who is not only willing to kind of work with a winner who's based here in the city or based in the local kind of area, you know, throughout where local woman magazine run, but also, you know, she's willing to bring them to the big smoke, take them over to London and let them get a taste for the really huge industry kind of competitive kind of areas, you know, let them get the opportunity to sample what it is like to live life as a model or a creative lady in the big smoke. You know, it's a huge opportunity for them. And the beauty behind this competition now is Natalie. How did it go tonight? Were you delighted with the turnout? Very delighted. That's why we had to have two bonus wild cards because all the judges couldn't make up their mind. They had their favorite girls. Um, but at the end of the day, it's about, uh, you know, like modeling, uh, print work and on the catwalk because some of the girls were good on the catwalk. And I took some of the pictures beforehand so I could show the judges what the girls look like on, on the camera as well. So overall it was very good, very good standards. Now each girl had very different looks. No, I was looking for the Irish look and there was Molly who had the very Irish, like the white skin, the black hair. So I really liked that look and um, all the other judges liked that. But then we liked the other girls for different reasons. So we, you know, it was different to, different judges wanted different things from the girls. So now you've seen the three girls from Cookstown, the three girls from Coolery, and now you have five girls from Derry. Are you excited about the final? I'm so excited. So it's in two weeks time. Um, so I just told the girls they have to prepare and this is the final and, and I choose one girl uh, for the modeling contract in London. So I said, you got to give it all, like you're all for this final. How do you feel about being chosen to go into the final in a couple of weeks? I'm ecstatic, I really wasn't expecting it, they called my name and I was, a couple of seconds when even process, it was my name, I was like, oh I'm coming! I don't know, I'm just ecstatic, I'm over the moon, I can't wait. Yeah, you kind of, whenever they call out your name, you're kind of waiting for someone else to walk up like, oh, oh god, that's me, alright, sorry. <laughs> no, but it's, it's fantastic, it's going to be a great opportunity, really great experience. To be honest, I'm still, I can't believe it, is it really me sitting here? <laughs> but I'm excited, exactly. So yeah, kind of in shock. I'm excited, really excited, I'm really happy. Now there was a little bit of a twist at the end. There was only supposed to be three going through to the final, but there were two wild cards and these two lucky ladies got through. So what did it feel like when you thought you hadn't made it and then you got another chance? Um, well, I was happy enough taking part, to be honest, and then when they called my name, I was lured. <laughs> Can't wait to get used to my benefit makeup. See, I didn't expect it at all, I thought, oh, well done. Grateful girls and then this name called out and I was like, oh my god, <laughs> I'm tough, Sam. Can't wait now, it'll be brilliant to take part and see everybody else do well, so look forward to it. Now there was loads of girls that took part. Uh, what was it like? Was it a good atmosphere, good fun? All the girls were absolutely amazing. So they were, uh, they were all hiding in the toilets the whole night and it was just great crack with all of them. I really, really enjoyed meeting all of them. Definitely. It's great getting to know, especially in this industry, it's great getting to know new people and new faces. and. Oh, it was great, they're really lovely years, really. Okay, well we'll be seeing these five girls will be joining three more from Coleraine and another three from Cookstown. So I wish us all the best and I'll see you at the final. Thank you. Woo